Hi, this is Sean Overton with OneStepRemove.com. I'm going to walk you through downloading historical data from Alpari's History Center and how to load it into any MetaTrader platform, then use it in your strategy tester. The way to get started is first to open up Alpari's History Center. If you don't know the address, it's easy to find. You can go to Google and do a basic search. Just type in History Center Alpari and it'll come right up. The page you see on the screen here is the page you want. And let's say that you want to get started with testing the Euro US dollar. The most accurate data available is the one minute left click and it'll start the download. Choose save and make sure you save the file to a location where you can find it. In this case, I like to use desktop because it's easy to find. Well, and I've already downloaded the data, so you would push save and then when it's done downloading, you'll see it right here on the desktop. The next step is I need to get the data out of the zip file. Most of you will use WinZip to do this. I have WinAce on my computer. The process is a little different, but the, the idea is the same. You'll see an extract button at the top. You want to extract it to your desktop. Push OK. And here in a second, you'll see that it's done. And there's a new file right there and it ends with HST this is a history file for MetaTrader our next step is to load this history file into MetaTrader and this is a common misconception most people think if you have Alpari's history data that you can't use it in another broker's software platform but that's not the case so you can use it with FXDD you can use it with Interbank it's not important so today we're going to load it in the FXDD platform and the way you do it is you click tools then history center and on the left you'll need to choose the name of your symbol so euro US dollar and then the time frame we downloaded a one minute file now you need to go over to the right here and choose import and you need to choose the location so in this case we're going to load the one minute euro US dollar chart from the desktop and you'll see the HST file here. If you don't see it, make sure you have the right file type. And in this case, it's metaquotesfile.hst. Push open, and you'll see this load. Then push OK. The final step is to double click on the one minute here. This is really important, and most people forget this step. The double clicking is what actually loads it into the History Center. After you double click, push close and you have historical data saved in MetaTrader. If you want to backtest a file, this is a pretty simple process. Click on View, then Strategy Tester. At the bottom of MetaTrader, you'll see it load. And now you just need to choose all the different parameters. So the name of the expert advisor, the symbol you want to look at. This is the different options. The modeling quality in MetaTrader is usually not too good. So the best way to do it is to use every tick, even though it takes the longest. Period. This is the time and the, the time frame you intend to trade. And the date's really not that important. If your strategy has merit, it should work on any time period that you look at. And to get started, just push start. You'll see these blue bars load up, and when it's ready to go, you'll see a graph. This is Sean Overton with OneStepRemove.com. Thank you for listening.